Evening all, it's Mark here from The Tipping Times. And today I'm just going to show you the quickest way to export a list to CSV. It can be any list that you want on any market. Um, you just need to be on the Quick Stats menu. Then you've got Quick Stats or Quick Lists. This is a simple export. So we're just going to go through quick lists, which will only give you one market. Quick stats is more complex, and you can do multiple filters in there, but we'll do that in another video. So I'll click to open it. Whilst it's loading up, just to confirm that the default for quick lists is set at 12 months. 12 months historical data of the home team playing at home and the away team playing away. And it's also defaulting to over 2.5 goals for the match. You can see you've already got your list here without having to do anything. Now, we've not populated this and we've not exported it, but I'm just going to show you how to change a couple of things around. So rather than doing the default over 2.5 goals, let's just do both teams to score. So you can see when you click on your select market, you select, then you've got a search box here, and you've got this little tab here which is selected one if you click on it you can see it's the over 2.5 goals that's selected for the match so let's just click on the box and let's change it to both teams to score you'll see how quick this is hopefully so it's that. and then we scroll down and we close it it's there already almost instant and then Here's your export button. Exported already. And just to say that when you export without any other filtering mechanisms, it'll export everything. If you just wanted tomorrow's fixtures, for example, you'd go into the find fixtures, fixtures to include. Click on that, and you can pick today or tomorrow. Yeah. So let's see what it looks like. There you go. That's your both teams to score list, essentially, done in less than two minutes. You drag them across and double click opens up all the all the columns and then what I like to do is put a little filter on it just like that so I can then search by day I can search by percentage as a default it will pull out and export anything that is 50% or over I tend to work at higher probabilities than that based on historical performance. But anyway, that's just a really quick guide on how to create a CSV export. You can do this yourself from any market and recover over a hundred of them. Hope that helps. Thanks for watching. Take care, Mark.